One shot day Naomi. Naomi? Whatever, who gives a fuck. So, since the last update, a lot of things have changed, obviously. There is a new difficulty with the 12th stage and artifacts. So I had to rethink how I'm gonna do my one shot days. Basically, I'm focusing on different dungeons and only bring into the 12th stage if it actually makes sense. So yeah, a lot of things actually have changed in here. What the fuck? <sighs> Damn it. One fucking time. I want to be prepared one fucking time before I start a stupid video. It can't be that hard, right? Come on, get it together. How stupid can you be? <sighs> so, once again. One shot day, Naomi. Naomi. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. So, Naomi, just like myself, was pretty much useless uh, her whole life. But now, Second Awakening is a thing, artifacts are a thing, and new dungeons are a thing. And she actually is not bad in that. So basically what I'm saying is that Naomi now has more uses than just being a uh, arousal material for you sick people. So the very first cool thing is that as soon as the enemy has a debuff on him, Naomi will always crit. She was made for me. She was made for this video series. Perfect. And also first skill has a chance to stun. 65k, we're off to a good start. Second skill attacks two times, leaves branding effect and decreases attack power by 25% for each attack. And should do more damage. 58 and 59 is over 100k, let's not make it complicated. <laughs> Water Rift, does it make sense? Well, I would say it makes 50% sense, because like, when he's up she will not crit very often, but when he's like lying down with debuffs and shit, she actually deals a shit ton of damage. So I think it's, it's fine to take her in here. To be honest, I have really high expectations for this. It's only 3 debuffs, but still. 233k. That is actually pretty decent. If you lack damage in this dungeon, I think the Omi can be very very decent. And now, second skill. Still only 3 debuffs, with other teams you can get actually more damage by putting more debuffs onto him. But let's keep it at 3 for now. 215, 211, that's 426k. Is that correct? I think it should be correct. Which is a lot. Naomi, decent, very decent actually in Water Rift. I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay, I'm getting sidetracked here. This has absolutely nothing to do with the video right now. But look at the cool new rewards! Ah. I'm getting sidetracked very easily. Mm, yeah, it, it does look cool. It does look cool, I can see the appeal of it. It's done. Cool. Second attack. Oh, it's done. Yes! And now, it's done. Damn it. Stun! Fuck! Stun! God damn it! Stun! Get, get stunned! What the hell? Get stunned! Come on! Stun! What is going on? Please stun this so I can actually... Ah, thank you! Finally! Is the video 8 minutes yet? Now to the interesting part. Can Naomi be actually be used in GB12? We'll see. Okay, the boss stage now. A lot of debuffs, which is good for Naomi because she does more damage. Same as Crow. Uh, oh no, Crow that, Crow that. But Naomi should carry this. If she brings out the second skill, that's done. Holy shit, that was over 70k damage. Holy shit. And that's fully auto. I think she's good. 1 minute 9, I take it. Some of you will die, but that's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. And Naomi finishes it off, and that was again, pretty fast. Let's look at the time. 1.7, even 2 seconds faster, nice. Damn, the doggo cat combo is actually really good. Crow and Naomi just finish him off immediately. 
One, two. Okay, that's like roughly one minute time. Naomi Good and Giants, confirmed. How about the new dungeon then? Steel Fortress. Super annoying dungeon. Everyone knows it. Beneficial block can really suck my. Hey, with this team, I have so many debuffs. And it complements Naomi so well. Oof, close to one shotting. She didn't even have attack buff. So nice. Naomi is a really good damage dealer. You can't say anything against that that very little cat. It's pretty decent. I like it. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Perfect scenario. Debuffs, debuffs, come on, give them the debuffs. Nice. Five debuffs. And Naomi. Bam. First skill. 46k. Without branding. Without branding. And without usage of the oh it's already dead. It's already dead. Can't even finish my goddamn sentence. One minute six. Cool. Take it. Try it again. Please ignore that my sync right now has the perfect AI. Maybe it's the YouTube bonus. Who knows? Normally he fucks up so much, but right now he's doing really well. <laughs> and yeah, the damage is still very consistent. This team is pretty good. As long as sync doesn't fuck up. Which definitely never happens, right? Never mind. How fast was that? 56 seconds under one minute. Cool. Woo! No way, that kind of sucks. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck! Yes! <laughs> I don't know, it feels so satisfying when Zinc actually does the right thing. I mean, this is the third run, and it's it, he did it perfectly three times in a row now. Oof, and Naomi one-shots. Nice! Okay, that would be pretty cool if that would be consistent. 52 seconds! <laughs> That's nice. I'll take it. So, that's actually the end of Naomi One Shot Day. I hope you enjoyed this one, this new kind of thing. If not, well, that sucks to be you. Ooh, ooh, second skill, second skill. How much damage does it do? I want to land the branding. 46 and 69! Nice! Okay, uh, getting sidetracked again, distracted, sorry. Um, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video, if not, well, sucks to be you, and hope to see you guys next time. Bye!